Hi there, and welcome to the Skelly Home Builder Trend Introduction. My name is Sean, and this is a short video on what Builder Trend is, how to set up Builder Trend, and how to use Builder Trend platform. So, first off, Builder Trend is a project management software that Skelly Home utilizes. Builder Trends allows you, the client, to access your project anywhere. Builder Trend allows you to get daily updates. It allows you to accept or decline change orders. It allows you to view the calendar to see what work is going on. Uh, it allows you to view the budget. And it also allows you to see photo progress reports throughout the entire project. Okay? The email you should have gotten is an invitation to join Builder Trend. So we are going to accept that invitation and set up your account. So go to your email that says you're invited to join Builder Trend. It should be titled Skelly Home Renovations Request Your Participation. At the bottom of that email, click Accept. That will take you to Builder Trend, where you will have to create a username and put in your password twice. Okay, so as you can see, I entered a username, my password, and my password twice. Great, now the setup is complete. Now we're going to actually log into Builder Trend to see what the platform looks like. Click login. Now this is the platform. So uh, first off, I'm going to start just from a high level what uh, each piece of this platform means. Uh, and then we're going to dive into each platform. So first off, this should be your name. Uh, this should be your address. Uh, the next part is the contract price and any payments that we have received and your total outstanding balance for the project. Uh, in this midsection, you should see the main picture of your home, as well as any before pictures of your home or what your home looks like looks like right now. To the right, it's going to go into what's happening. So this is essentially where you're going to see and receive messages about your project, and we're going to go through each of these in a second. Next, it has the weather. This is a snapshot of what the weather is in the location of your home. Uh, then it has, at the bottom, it has the calendar. So this is so you can see what's going on uh, for um, essentially the week of right now, October 19th to October 21st, 25th. And then this is the comment. So these are any comments uh, that have that we have asked or you have asked us. Okay, so let's keep going. Uh, at the top, you're going to see your project manager and their phone number. So at any point in time, you can know their phone number just from logging in to your owner's portal. Okay, now this top platform, uh, this top bar. So this top bar has a lot of good information. So the first thing we're going to go to is to-dos. So this section of to-dos, it's also found in the what's happening, is are there anything outstanding for yourself? So whether that is countertop selections or cabinetry drawings, these are going to be to-dos that you are notified that you need to do. The next section is the calendar. So you can access the calendar from this top bar or from view full calendar on the bottom bar. When you click view full calendar, you will actually see what is going on in your project. In this project, which is an example project, we are submitting the permits. We are currently waiting on the city to finalize its review of the permits. Okay, great. Uh, the next, we're going to go up to the bar again, the next is the daily logs. So your project manager will update you with daily logs throughout the week uh, at least two times. So this one was sent on 1020 and says permits are currently reviewed by city. Next week we'll be meeting with the following subs to discuss the rough ends. Let me know if you have any questions. So you the owner may have questions on this. And if you do, you can always comment. So let's say you say, uh, great, what day do you expect to stop by with the subs. 
and this will be emailed directly to your project manager and they will respond. So that's really simple and these are called what's called your daily logs. Uh, documents, so these are any documents that we have uploaded. Uh, you can see we have before photos in here. Uh, videos, photos, these will also show you the photos. So again, these are your before photos. Messages, so this is where you can send an email. So you click compose new message and you send it to whoever you're trying to send it to with the subject and as you're used to you just compose the email and click send here. This goes directly to your project manager. Uh, next is comment. So the comment section is exactly the same um, section that you commented on our daily logs. It just logs it here where you said great. What do you expect? When? What day do you expect to stop by with the subs? So you will see comments here throughout the entire project. Uh, the next is change orders. So when um, we have change orders, they will come to you through this change order area and it will say open change order and you can accept it or you can decline it. If you do accept it, you'll notice that this summary area will have not only contract price and project running total, it will also have change order amounts. So that will come through through here so you can always stay updated on your project balance. Okay. Next is the estimate. So the estimate is the invoice that you have signed. If you have any questions about what is on the invoice or the detail on the invoice or estimate, you can come to the estimate tab and you can access exactly what is included in your project and also the price. Okay, so again, I hope this was super helpful. We went through setting up your account and also an overview of your owner's portal platform. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to either your project manager or your sales representative. Have a wonderful day.